Hey guys, I just wanted to show you here is my Steel Series Sensei Frost Blue uh, Raw Limited Edition. Here it is. You can see how it um, illuminates and goes down right around here as well. So the buttons here, so this is my quick review of it. Uh, you got two buttons here, you can actually program them to do what they want. But this is actually a back button when you're surfing the web. Okay, And this is a forward button. Uh, here's the scroll wheel. This is your DPS uh, switch. Um, it'll actually make it uh, sensitive, just like that. It'll go on. You can turn it off just like that. On the other side, you got two more buttons, which also you can program to do whatever you want. But they actually do. If you don't, and you just use the default, it actually will turn out to be the same buttons that uh, you do for your, um, uh, like I said, the forward and back on your web browser. Okay. Uh, now, how do I feel about this mouse? Well, this mouse is actually pretty good. It feels like a um, like a, a Mac mouse, basically. It has the same t uh, same type of plastic that you feel on a Mac mouse. The clicking is very good, um, but it's just you know two buttons um, there. Other than that, it, it fits pretty comfortably in the hand. Uh, on on the bottom here, you can see it's a laser mouse, so. Uh, and this this uh, Teflon sort of um, coating they have on the on the really does make a slide better, uh, and you do have a lot more precision um, when you when you game. I, I know I was quite skeptical when I first got the gaming mouse. You know I thought making a DPS switch doesn't make a huge difference, but it actually does, and it does make it uh, you're you're way more accurate on your mouse clicks. So if you have any questions, comments, please post them below. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. So how do I how would I rate this product? It's actually a really good product. I got it on sale, so I didn't pay a lot of money for it. So if you paid a lot of money for it, then you might want to go for the higher end one because this is, a, I believe, uh, it's actually not your basic um, uh, Steel Series mouse, but you uh, you can actually get them to be at like over hundred dollars if you really want a gaming mouse. You can also adjust things. Uh, this is pretty basic, so for the money I'm, um, I paid, I, I think it's a really good deal. So if you have any questions, like I said, post them below.